What is up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another episode of Flotsam. By the way, it's Flotsam, not Flotsam. F O L T. It would be F O L A T if it was Flotsam. I've heard people call this game Flotsam. It's kind of weird. It's Flotsam, but we're back. Pretty much right after recording the previous episode, because that's how dedicated I am to this game. Yes, and I love this game so much. But we're back in Flotsam, in Bubbleton. Um, I can't actually see where our town is called Bubbleton. I, I, I like, I'm looking for a, a designated thing that shows Bubbleton, but I don't see anything. But we're back in Bubbleton with Boaty McBoat, and I'm now going to do the thing that will probably end this Let's Play very quickly. Oh, there we go. Well, he's he's off out. Who, who's driving? <gasps> it's Kevin Costner. Go, Kevin. Go. Go. By the way, if you have any names that are... Um pun related like Kevin Costner please let me know because I do love puns like that I mean like do we have a Wilson hey, hello. no we've got sea legs and fish bait I think at one point we will just have to call someone Wilson or maybe find a Wilson because I do understand a lot of the names in this game are puns already or nautical related like fish bait and all that kind of stuff Kevin Costner was just one that came off the top of my head. I have no idea why. I, I thought, well, yeah, let's not talk about it. <laughs> but we're gathering plastic. We need plastic. And by the way, as you can see, I'm managing to stay on top of my water supply. I'm well happy. But over here, you can see this thing blinking at me. Which is the salvaging point that I talked about last time. Sailbot on the rocks. So I'm going to set that to salvage. Uh, and hopefully at some point... Hopefully soon they will go and salvage that so we can actually move on. But what I really need to do is put down another... Can I stick two there? I don't know, but I'm going to need a plastic storage. Now this thing, this this main tower here, holds a hundred. So it holds a hundred, but that that's, you know, firewood. Whoa, 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 what are you doing putting firewood there? No, don't, don't go putting firewood there. So, water plastic, fish, uh, I will set up a designated fishing spot when fish come around. Uh, excuse me, I've got an itchy nose. But I think the main thing, as Kevin Costner goes out fishing... Is he going plastic or is he going... <gasps> is he going south? Where's Kevin Costner? Where's Costner? Oh, something happened. The thing's not in the dock. Oh! Oh, he salvaged Oh, he did! Oh, the thing was on the opposite side. Okay, so we missed that, sadly. Um, is it Kevin Costner? Oh, no, we've got... Sea Legs. Sea Legs is doing it. Oh, by the way, something I should have shown you. They have traits. So she moves faster, and a new world... A temporary rejuvenated... I don't know what that one does. But if we open them up, um, what does Kevin Costner have? Kevin Costner has torpedo. Fish bait has... Moist. Okay, okay, don't call it moist. Um, drinks less, that's good. That's probably why my thing has been holding up. That explains a lot, actually. That explains quite a lot. Okay, so let's bump in some more of them so we can get keep our water production going. I'm going to get in another bed right here. And by the way, every time I hear that little riff, that bang, my brain wants to go, Summer hath gone and path. I don't know the rest of that song, but it's that Green Day song, uh, Wake Me Up When September Ends, or whatever. That's the only thing it reminds me of. But we could set sail right now. We could set sail. We could stick the sail on, and we could go. But we're not going to, because we've still got a lot of stuff around here that we need to gather. Now, the fish is running out, the, the food, but we have 15 left. So I will probably not set out until we have five left. Which should give us enough time to gather enough plastic. Hopefully. Hope for Lee. So, hopefully, and I'm, I'm saying hopefully a lot because I'm hoping for a lot. Oh, we're out of, oh, we're out of wood. We're out of wood. We've, we're, we're not, we're not getting wood. So, let's get that. Let's put a swimming buoy down to get the rest of that. And let's turn, I turned wood off on that. Let's turn wood back on on that. In fact, let's... Let's get... 
that stuff as well. There we go. Someone will go out and get that. Hopefully I'm not overloading them with instructions to go and mine and swim and all that kind of stuff. Uh, hopefully. Hopefully. <laughs> hopefully is the way... To today, to today's episode's called Hopefully, ladies and gentlemen. Hopefully. We will need to move on today, though, I do believe. I think today's main goal is get to the point where we are well stocked so we can pedal on out of here. And I think the only thing we really need to do... Oh, oh, there we go. Out swimming. I think the main thing we need to do is finish this side. So finish this side right here. And then we can set it out, I do believe. We've got enough dry wood right there. Which gets turned into our firewood right here. So let's get five more of that made. So I've got an even 20 left. We're gathering plastic. We're drying out a few bits of wood. What, see, this is the thing. I turn off production for one thing. Production for the other thing skyrockets. And then I forget that I've turned off the production for the other thing. Therefore I run out of it really quick. Like I turned off production for wood. So everyone would focus on plastic. Like Kevin Costner is focusing on plastic. Um, and then I run out of plastic. And plastic is the main thing for building the struts that hold your entire thing together. Uh, so, the, the, you know, these these walkway segments, the plastic. Um, I do believe the beds. Storage is a lot of plastic. And the beds is a lot of plastic as well. Uh, drying racks, plastic. Water, plastic. Boat, uh, plastic. This, no plastic. Ooh. So I think what we do, I have 24 plastic. Okay, let's go out another eight like I did on the previous one. So that's 16, there we go, eight. And then bring it down and boop, uh, boop it in so I can stick it in another bed. Therefore, they all have a bed each uh, because they don't share beds. As soon as a bed puts down, it gets assigned to a person and you can't unassign it. So, you know, if Kevin Costner doesn't have a bed, then he's just gonna sleep anywhere. And that's not good, because a tired one, because uh, if they're not sleeping in a bed, they don't sleep fast enough if you get my like, they've got bars. Um, if I pull up the person tab, you can see here, they have a sleep bar, a water bar, a food bar, and a health bar. If they're sleeping on the ground, that thing goes up extremely slowly, and it has percentages now, which is pretty cool, so you can track it. Don't know if it had percentages before. His health is fine. Um... And I still haven't messed with these. I still haven't messed with them. They're all producing stuff on their own, which is good. Water production's good. We're on 10. Now, I said we would leave on 5. And I think that should be the main goal, to leave on 5. What I do need to do is... How are we doing for wood? What's left there? One wood... Two plastic. Right, okay. Uh, hmm. Do you know what? I'm going to do another jump cut to when we're more self-sufficient. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I've come back and just about ten minutes has passed. We got the buoyant floater fishing boat because we're about to we're about to move we're about to move the city. So it's time to build our engine power, which is this sail. Uh, which I can stick in right there. And we need to go because I said I have a safety buffer of five food. As you can see, I'm on zero food. So we have to move or we will die. Tragically. So let's set sail. Let's open up the map and move on to the next area. So Bubbleton is right here right now. But we're going to move to the Lonely Island. It's the, it's, we've got to do it. There's no fish where we are. We need to go start fishing. So, let's find some fish. Excuse me, there we go, fish, right there. Right there, and I'm not even going to waste time, I'm just going to plonk that down right there. And someone's going to go out fishing, because we need fish. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this drying rack and turn it to a fish one. And then, here, basically dead centre, I'm going to stick up a thing where I can store the fish because uh, I'm not going to store fish in the center I'm going to store fish here so I can just boop boop I found that being 
the shortest distance from one area to the other is probably the best thing. So boop, not on that, and just fish. And this is going to dry fish, and here they come with it right back. Now, we're not going to do anything. We have, we have the ability to sustain water pretty damn well. Um plastic right there yeah we can we can sustain water pretty damn easily so do you know what I'm gonna do I'm gonna set it to just come and take out that so what um, Kevin Costner is it Kevin Costner Kevin Costner is driving boating with boat he's gonna head on out gather us some wood so we can sustain our ability to hold this going oh whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, I'm actually just gonna make one and there we go. The rest will be the rest will be firewood. Yes, I think that's a very good idea. Cause now we're kind of in that in that nice um, sufficient area. The thing is that we need food because people don't have food and they're going to start dying. Um, Kevin Coulson doesn't have food and sea legs. Oh, there we go. She's she's just eating. What the hell did she eat? Did those fish dry out really quick. How long does it actually take? It doesn't say how long it takes, but what we need to do is we need to dry out a bunch of fish and then we can keep our guys alive. And then there's two islands here. We have this island right here, which has Coralton, Coralton, Coral, Coralton, okay, yep, yeah, okay, Coralton and Kelp, Sweaty and Windbreaker. Right, okay. And then over here we have the ability to uh, scavenge at the shack town, which is something we will have to do eventually, because to get research points we have to scavenge. Follow my drill? Follow my drill. So right now we're just going to try and keep our production of water going. We're on 18 water. That's okay. Our fish dry pretty quick, but I think what I will... Whoa! Do you hear that? They're all just kind of yelling at me. Stop stop yelling at me. Okay, there we go. We're nice and in a safe distance away. So we're going to have to make some more food production, I think, is probably the best thing. Because I am going to rescue the people here. Hmm. Let's think, let's think, let's think. We've got a good wood production. Yeah, he's coming over here, he's going to get the wood. We've got a good wood production going. We've finally got food production going. And at the minute, food's not going to stack, because what it'll do is the food will go into where it gets stored, uh, which should probably be... All right, yeah, no, food gets stored there. That's okay. Um, so the food will get stored and then immediately eaten. Are they still yelling? No, okay, they're not yelling. Why are you holding fish? You're not supposed to be holding any of that stuff. Neither are you. Come on. There we go. That's better. And you shouldn't be holding fish either. Yeah, it is kind of weird. It does kind of just auto-throw things in places that they shouldn't be. Um... But have we... Okay, we farmed all those fish. Oh, damn, okay. Let's find more. Let's find more. And you can tell where they are because there they are. The jumping... I think it's like salmon. Oh, no, that's not the one I want. This is the one I want. Is, is it salmon? Do sa no, not salmon. Is it tuna? A tuna is the one that swims... Kind of like the underwater... Um, version of those birds that fly in formation. Is that, is that what we have? I don't know. I really don't know. Let's get some more of this going. So we're okay with plastic at the minute. We don't really need to expand. But what I will do is build another bed right there. Because if we head over here, there's two people. So four beds should keep them going for a while. I'm really looking for more fish, though. There's got to be more fish. No? No more fish? Not hiding out anywhere? Ah, oh, that's a shame. So do you know what? We'll get this, we'll set this to scavenge. So most likely Kevin Costner will take his boat out, go scavenge that. Um, they can find resources that way, so they can find food. 
and uh, dried wood and all that kind of stuff because they just go out and like rip down the town. So we're going to keep an eye on Boaty McBoat, see who takes it out um, and goes to scavenge that island because that boat's now freed up. So someone is taking out, is that sea legs? That's fish bait. Fish bait is off to, where are you going fish bait? Are you scavenging? She is scavenging, so she should pull up like right here. Yep, and then boop, 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 up they go. And they just shake it for a little bit. What have we found? We found some wood. You can, you can actually just click here and see what you found. So we found three research points and ten dried wood. Now these boats only hold ten. Uh, so at some point, you know what, I should probably do that now. I'm going to build another mooring dock. Where can I build it? Okay, there. This is going to be my dock area because it's the closest to the thing. By the way, any any boat can share any dock. It's not one one mooring dock becomes, you know, one for the fish and one for the thing. It's just whichever one's the closest they dock to, um, which is something I like. And you see, you see, you see, I haven't messed with this. Uh, we need more of this though. Oh, we can make an even seven. So we're drying, we're, yeah, see, we've got dried wood now, but we're drying wood at a slower rate because we're now drying fish and wood. Um, so my wood production is going to stall a little bit until I can focus more, uh, which is why I'm getting this second boat. One fishing boat um, holds ten. Yeah, I think they both hold ten. Uh, so one fishing boat holds ten, which is enough to kind of keep you going. It's best to have two boats. Um, so what I'm going to need is more plastic. Oh, which is okay, because there's one right there. 65 plastic. Someone will go out. I'm actually going to turn... No, where is it? I'm going to turn this one off. As so you can just click it to turn it off, or you can remove the marker. Just going to remove the marker. And I'm going to look at my research right now. No, that's the map. I'm going to look at my research real quick. I only have three research points. Now, I don't know if you're supposed to work your way down the tech tree or if you can just pick things willy-nilly. But I think going for the fish kebab would probably be the best thing because the fish kebab has a nutritional value of one, whereas dried fish only has a nutritional value of 0.5. So it takes two dried fish to keep them going, whereas it would take one fish kebab to keep them alive. And we're running out of water. So he's off fishing. Don't know where my boat is. Oh, there he is. Okay. Okay, so I've just, I've just like for about 30 seconds, which is what that entire cut was about. I've just had a thought. It's probably best to go and rescue the people now. We're still salvaging the island. We found 20 dry wood and only three, but I think it's probably best to go save Carlton and Kelp. By the way, I did call... Uh, Cor I'm going to call him Carlton. I'm not calling him Carlton. Carlton just sounds like I've got some sort of speech problem. Um, but I'm going to go and save those two pretty soon, I think, because we're going to need more people. I'm running out of plastic. So I've set a plastic buoy up here, but I should probably set that as a swimming buoy because it's within range. So if we boop that, people will people will eventually go out and swim to that and get me some plastic. I've turned my wood one off over here, and people are still, you know, people are still going out and doing that. My inventory is not full though. I'm happy about that. My inventory is not full, and the water production is being okay for now. The food production is 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 terrible. Hmm. I don't know. I think I might have to leave this episode on a cliffhanger. Mm, I think I will. I think I'm going to... Uh, yeah, do you know what? For suspense, I think I'm going to leave you all on a cliffhanger. Because... We're out of fish. That's it. We need to rescue those two people and get the hell out of here. So, we're going to set that to rescue. I was hoping to get enough plastic to make another salvaging boat. But I don't have enough... Uh, but we are drying wood at a good rate now, so do you know what? We'll do that. There's a person... Yeah, because this is so close, people can just swim out and pick up. I don't know if they Hello. carry ten of fire. Hello, fishbait. 
I don't think they carry 10 or 5. Let's have a look. They carry 5. Right, okay. That's... Yeah, it's not too bad. Uh, but yes. See, we're running out of... We have 9 fish. 10, 11. We have 11 fish. We have 11 fish. So we need to rescue those guys and get the hell out of here. So... There they are. They're over there. Yeah, we're going to need to rescue them and get the hell out of here. And we need to finish salvaging that area. So... I'm not going to... I'm not going to do it. I was going to tweak. But... I'm going to sit that down there to be constructed. So we have two boats. Because you you, you can't use fishing boats for salvaging. Um, or rescuing people. It's only for fishing. And we don't have enough fish to sustain everybody. So we have to get those guys out of there. And then move on. So I could I could change the priority. So in here, this this eye is the is right here. You know, landmark salvaging, scavenging, and investigating. I could turn that up, but I don't think I want to right now. I think I want to let them produce the water, uh, like they're doing. There's two water left to produce. That's okay. They're going to take the fish down, put the fish back up. Do we have room left for? Yeah. Okay. So we've got enough wood. That's fine. We've got ten wet wood and thirty three dry wood. That one bit of metal. So we need. To... There we go. The boat's being made. So let's actually just rename, well, not rename, uh, the Buoyant Floater. That's a funny name. But we have Boating Boat. What's this one going to be called? I like that person still swimming out. This is the Sloppy Dinghy. <laughs> is the Sloppy, where's the Sloppy Dinghy going? Right, yeah, give me a name to rename that. We're not calling it the Sloppy Dinghy. That sounds like an innuendo. We're not calling it a Sloppy Dinghy. So let's see what Kevin Costner finds. Oh, Kevin Costner, sorry. Let's see what he finds. Oh, he's found five fuel. Oh, you beautiful man. Oh, and three more research points. Oh, you're absolutely beautiful. And he's just found more fuel. Oh, Kevin Costner, you are beautiful. You are absolutely beautiful. You found me fuel, which means I don't need to burn any of that. Uh, well, I don't need to turn it into anything and do that because he's just going to come in and stick it in. <laughs> giggity, giggity, goo. Um... Are you? Will someone please move the fish out of there? Because that's where our that's where our fuel goes. So have we rescued the guys? No, we still haven't rescued the guys yet. Oh, 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 oh! Someone's taking out the sloppy dinghy. Oh, Jesus, I'm not gonna. I'm, someone's taking out the SD. There we go. Will someone take out the other? Will someone take out Boaty McBoat and go rescue those guys? Uh, so we can end the episode. Pretty please. Oh, I just realised we're also playing at super high speed. Let's not do that. Let's let's move down to just high speed, and let's see what they find because this is about to be end this is about to finish. So, more fuel. What are you gonna find in that one? Ooh, three tins and two bits of of, of stuff. So I think, unless she goes back up. Oh, she's going back up. What have you found for me? Oh, you found me more food. Is that the end of this place? I think that might be the end of this place. I don't know. I've, I've only ever really scavenged one before. And that didn't really have a lot into it. So what's she bringing back? Two bits of fuel and eight food. I have a sneaking suspicion there's more food over there. But with that eight food, we can actually relax a little bit. Which is good because that fills one. That fills a whole one. Does that tin food? So yeah, tin food has a food value of one, like the fish kebab. Mmm, I'm happy now. Our water production is steady. <laughs> They're still swimming out here to get the plastic. That's pretty funny. Uh, have they gone and rescued anyone yet? Nope, they haven't gone and rescued anyone yet. <sighs> I think. If they can rescue them within the next five minutes, we should be fine. But I think... Because we don't have a lot of food left... Mm, I don't know what to do. I'm trying to think. And I really hate the name of this dinghy. Okay, where are you going? Where are you taking the SD? Oh, it's Kevin Coulson driving. Is he heading back out to the island? He's heading back to the island. Whoa, back to the island. 
Whoa, we're gonna have a party. Do -do -do. What are you gonna What are you gonna get for me, Kevin Costner? Anything good? Anything good? Come, 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 come. What are you gonna get me, boy? And uh, more food, yes. I think that might be it, though. Nope, he's still going. What is on this island, for crying out loud? Please be more food. Oh, it was just one more food. Yeah, just one? Yeah, okay, so that's six extra food. That's great. How much do we have in there? Six. We're on 12 food, plus whichever whichever little bit of fish we have remains. So there we go. It gives us a little notification that it's done. So now all we have to do is rescue the peeps. We are... Oh, okay, let's, let's let's get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven more done. Uh we should take that out of there. We can yeah. Because we're not we're not when we run out of room, we're not making dry wood again. So there's six in there, there's five in there. Hopefully they will unload that food real quick, because people need to eat. And then hopefully someone will take out Boaty McBoat and go rescue the people. I have set them yes, I've set them to be rescued, so we need to go rescue them real quick. Yes! Oh, damn it, I was hoping it was Kevin Ghost now, but it's Fishbait. Fishbait is going to go rescue uh, Coral and Kelp. Yeah, we're going to rename them. Let me let me, let me me know what you want to rename them in the comment section down below. But look at that, 11 food, 20 water. Whew, that's good. That's good. So, I, I love watching this. So, we pull in right here, ready for this. Do, 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 boink, 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 boink. We've rescued kelp, was it? And that should be... Boom, boom, there we go, little notification, we're done. We're all gonna get on the dinghy and get out of here. And let's just watch them head back. So we can end it right there. That's beautiful, that's a beautiful sight as they pull back in to port. How nice is that? It's nice to see teamwork, because teamwork makes the dream work. So I've got, you know, a good amount of wood, a good amount of, of plastic. So I think it's about time that we move on, but we'll do that next episode, ladies and gentlemen. So, thank you for coming along today. You know the drill. Like, share and subscribe. And until the next time, stay awesome.